Alright, hello everyone. Um, today we're going to be doing a short and sweet video on microphones. Uh, this is currently being recorded on an Editage ETM-001 omnidirectional microphone on the camera. It's literally right there. Um, great microphone for recording environments. If I'm outside and I want to listen to the birds and the, the, my footsteps when I'm taking up, when I'm hiking, when I'm taking a hike, and the snails, you want to hear everything. Um, great microphone for that. If, you want, if you're sitting in a car and you want to hear the engine noise and the tire noise and the wind noise and everything, and me talking, great microphone for that. Um, if you're trying to do an interview in an echoey room like we are right now, not too great. I mean, it works just fine, but you'll see in a second. As a solution, I have found a lapel microphone. Okay, I honestly don't know where it's from. I just literally found it in the other room. I was like, ah! And so I'm going to try it right now. Actually, I tried it before, but I'm not going to tell you that. Yeah, anyway, so this, again, is the Edutige ETM-001. This is the camera's... So I'm going to try it again in the same range so you can hear. This is the camera's built-in stereo microphone on top of the camera. Just the one that most vloggers use, to be honest. Or they use a Rode video mic, but that's beside the point. Oh! Hmm. Durability test. Does, is the cable still attached? Yes. So what happened there? I stepped on the cable, which yanked it off my shirt. Anyway. So we're going to put it back. And plug it in. Moment of truth. How does it sound, huh? In, in my opinion, from reviewing the footage on the camera, uh, it sounds better. It's partly because it's physically closer to my mouth. I mean, so it has to record like a smaller radius, and so it doesn't get as much of the echoes, which is understandable, and that's great. I mean, that's what they're for. That's why you put them here, right? The same thing with the boom microphone. If I had the, a boom, and I put it right here, slightly out of shot, it would be kind of the same distance from my mouth. It might actually be better, but I don't have a boom or a boom mic. <laughs> so this is what this is all you're gonna get. Um, it, again, in my opinion, it's better. You don't get as much of the echoes. It's better for an interview. If you're really serious, you would use both. You'd use that one to record all the birds and the, the footsteps and the snails, and this one to record me talking. And you can mix them afterwards, and you can get both, and it'd be mint, dude. So. What am I getting to here? Don't use the in-camera microphone if you have another option, okay? Um, in this case, I do have another option, <laughs> and I'm using it right now. Uh, if you're trying to get a lapel microphone, they're very cheap on Amazon. Look up lav mic, um, get one with a 12-foot cable like I did. I mean, I found. And because then, then you can put the camera miles away, and you can do an interview with a telephoto lens, which not very many people do. Um, so that's that. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you liked it. Leave a like if you didn't like it. Shamelessly ripped from Cam Courier. And we'll see you guys next time.